I can't see forever, but I know that it's there. Out beyond the farthest buoy, I can see from my beach chair. It was one of a pair. Hello everyone, it's me Sarah. Welcome again to another video. So it's spring and this is one of my favorite seasons here in Japan guys because of sakura trees or cherry blossoms. So today, I've just thought to give you a tour around here in my neighborhood guys. So you could um, see how beautiful sakura trees here in my place. So, so I'm just gonna walk throughout our tour para mas lalo natin ma-appreciate yung ganda ng sakura trees. So let's go guys. I don't know guys if you've already knew that um, cherry blossom typically um, stay on trees for about 10 days or one week at most. So parang ano lang siya guys. San linggo pag -ibig. So kailangan mo siyang sulitin within one week. So that's why guys everyone here in Japan checks um, cherry blossom forecast in springtime. In that way we can really appreciate the beauty of Sakura as its peak. But today guys, nag nagpo fall off na yung mga petals from the trees kasi um, actually nag full bloom na siya no April 8 so um, it's um, April 12 today so 4 days na yung um, have passed by guys so nag ano na sila nag uh, nag fall off na talaga yung mga petals so so kunti na lang makikita yung mga flowers and and after that guys kapag nag fall off na yung um, sakura o yung flowers um, napapalitan na siya ng ano ng, ng dahon so ito siya guys pakita ko sa inyo and FYI guys ito yung ginagamit na ano na ingredient uh, dun sa mga sakura flavor na mga uh, food dahon pala yung ginagamit <laughs> ito siya kasi dati akala ko yung mismong uh, bulaklak yung ano uh, ginaga ginagamit nila pampalasa dun sa mga uh, food, yung dahon pala yung dahon guys yeah, nice to know diba yeah. and, and guys this tree is called sakura dory tree yes, kita nyo naman, dami nyo sakura hanggang dun siya sa dulo hanggang dun sa may hospital <laughs> namin yes. dun may mga upuan sila dyan no? para dun ka magpahinga We are here at Gander River, guys. And ito yung view. Ang daming sakura. So, guys, in furnace, napaka-init. <laughs> and, and, actually, guys, galing pa ako ng night duty. So, I've just slept for two hours. And then, after that, I um, head off right here para mag, ano, sakura viewing or cherry blossom viewing. And also, para pakita sa inyo yung um, sakura here in my place. Yes. So guys, just a little bit of knowledge. Um, sakura trees ano, has the many um, species guys. So to name a few guys, like here in my place, they have um, so, so may Yoshino, which is the most um, cultivated species of sakura here in Japan. And you can actually um, see these trees or see these sakura flowers throughout Japan. And it's like this guys. Oh. It's like here guys. Uh, light pink color and then uh, usually may five petals lang siya, guys and guys they also have kanzan square trees or double blossom as they called and meron parang ito siya meron din ako nakita dito along the gandor river I'm gonna, I'm gonna show it to you guys here it is and they also have shidare Zakura guys or Japanese weeping trees. Ito naman guys, yung parang yung branches niya. It has um waterfall or curtain like um effect and sobrang ganda niya. And everything na nakita ko noon, I feel like na napaka magical ng trees na yun kasi sobrang ganda niya. You can also um see Japanese weeping trees um throughout Japan and 
Um, pero medyo konti lang siya. Pero nakakita ko na sa Nagoya, Kyoto, and then sa Anara. Diba? Yes. And last but not the least is the Kanji Sakura guys. Ito naman is type of Sakura na makikita nyo sa mga medyo mainit na lugar like Okinawa. Basta dun sa southern part ng um, Japan. Pero para nakita ko nito sa Kyoto. Medyo ano siya. So medyo mas mahaba yung petals niya compared dun sa Somei Yoshino. Medyo deeper yung shade ng pink niya guys. Typical blossom season starts from the end of March to the beginning of April. But if you are planning to travel here in Japan, guys, I suggest that you check the um, cherry blossom forecast before you book your ticket going here to Japan because it varies every year. And guys, it depends also sa lugar. And so the warmer the places, mas um, mas nauna sila mag-bloom and the colder the places, mas late sila mag-bloom. So, for example, dun sa southern part ng Japan, which is medyo mainit dun, like Okinawa and Fukuoka and then Hiroshima. So, mas nauna sila mag-bloom compared dun sa northern part ng Japan, like um, Hokkaido and here in my place, in Toyama. So, it's better to check the um, Sakura forecast before going here in Japan. So guys, I'm really enjoying my coffee, guys. And sarap niya. It's called Mild Milk Coffee. And you can buy this um, from Kumeda Coffee Shop. I guess, pwede ba siya mabili sa mga convenience stores, guys? Kasi bigay lang sa akin ito ng Japanese ng co-worker. And ang sarap niya. Thank you for this. Uh, arigato gozaimashita. You come and make it clear What to love and what to fear Another question guys, why Sakura is very important to Japanese people and it is because um, Japanese often compared um, the short blooming period of Sakura sa transition ng life ng tao. Um, parang um, it reminds us that um, every beginning has an end and life is beautiful yet very short. That's why guys live life to the fullest. I don't know how you're gonna do it but live life to the fullest <laughs> so to enjoy the short life leading beauty of sakura trees or cherry blossom japanese always um do hanami during spring or when the sakura is starting to bloom and like we did ni um Bea last week sa ano kansui park toyama kung saan makita niyo yung uh one of the most beautiful sa starbucks here in japan and for me guys it's a it's a unique experience kasi um um, kasi sa Pilipinas walang masyadong park so compare here in Japan so hindi kami masyadong um, hindi ko masyadong na-experience mag-picnic sa Pilipinas and it's like also a uh, time na rin to bond with your friends and your loved ones during Hanami So I think I haven't mentioned it yet guys, during spring or sakura season here in Japan, a lot of Japanese um, stores here sell um, sakura inspired food, drinks, tumblers, and even lotion and face mask too guys. And they are really adorable and cute na parang gusto mo na silang bilindahan. Pero hindi pwede guys kasi maubos yung pera natin. Kailangan magtipid, kailangan magipon guys. before I end up this vlog guys I just want to add that there's um, in some places here in Japan um, pwede mo nyong hawakan yung sakura flowers pero may mga um, lugar din dito sa Japan hindi pwedeng hawakan ng sakura so better check on that and plus yung hindi nyo dapat talaga gawin is yung um, pitasin yung sakura flowers from the uh, no, sakura trees it's a big no no guys but pwede but pwede nyo namang um, kunin yung mga 
um, sakura flowers na nahulog na dun sa lupa. And pick us up with that. And that's okay. And that's fine. Yes. So, guys, I'm just gonna head back home now. And I hope you enjoy our um, vlog today. And so, I hope to see you again on my next vlog. So, bye-bye. Goodbye. Paalam. Sayonara. Bye.